I I think. Sorry. Sorry, I was just being impulsive. I don't want this background music though. D does anyone have uh, like a link uh, to the the best camp uh, background songs? We are trying to make a Smasher Pass list for Baldur's Gate. Start from the beginning? Okay. Carlac. Would I smash Carlac? Can I be honest with you guys? I would probably smash every NPC. Okay, Carlac. I would smash. I can't deny that she's the hottest person in the game. Because she's literally hot. She's so hot that you can't touch her because she's burning hot. But it sounds like an interesting thing. Not, not to mention that Carla, she has a very goofy personality. And I feel like smashing her would not only be like enjoyable, but also fun. Does that make sense? By the way, I don't think I would be committed to any of those NPCs. Yeah. I'm just talking about smash, like one, one night stand, I'll right? Asterion? So... <sighs> Okay, my my relationship with Asterion is complicated. I love Neo's voice. I have been a fan of his voice acting since Resident Evil 3. Because of that, I really liked Asterion. But the thing about Asterion is that I really hate him. If you guys watched my first playthrough of Baldur's Gate, I was actually making fun of Asterion and calling him a little bitch all the time. Asterion is the one character in this game I haven't seen the full romance of. And I really want you, but since we keep doing challenge runs, it's really hard. But I like him. I think I would smash. Mostly because... You know that scene? When he bites your neck? I find that to be really hot. Even though he's kind of annoying. But, you know... Okay, Mintar. I still remember how I felt the first time that I got myself into a sex scene with Mintar. I couldn't believe my eyes. I just couldn't. The shock with Mintara was because on early access, you could romance companions, but whenever the romance scene would start, there would be a mind flayer face and attacks that stayed under construction. And I seriously believe that Baldur's Gate is the game that has blue balled the most people. I kind of believe that the reason why I'm so attracted to Mind Flayers is because of that. Every time I try to romance a character in this game, I saw the face of a Mind Flayer instead. I'm honestly surprised I didn't develop some kind of attraction to the words under construction. With this in mind, this is what I was expecting when I started flirting with Mintara. But Mintara actually had a sex scene on Early Access. And oh boy, it was hot. But the funny thing is, when the game released, they somehow made that scene even hotter. Mintara literally sits on your face. Mintara is the kind of person that you're like, you're feeling bad for killing out the tieflings. You're feeling bad that so many people died. But the moment that she sits on your face, you suddenly forget they all existed. And I don't know if it makes it even better that she tries to kill you right after she sits on your face. She sits on your face and then she tries to slice your throat. How do you get any sexier than that? I would definitely smash. Many times. Can you add a picture of Grease to the list? A picture of what? Grease? Grease? Can I, you, you're talking about the, the tier list? Okay, if you guys send me a very cute cropped picture of the Grease icon in game, I will add Grease. But we'll talk about Grease when we get to there. Laser. Yeah, I think I need to share this with you guys. This is my screenshot manager for Baldur's Gate. 
The reason why I took this screenshot over here, it's because of the hips of this woman. I just find that this woman has the best shaped body. But that's not the topic. I think I would do it. Really Minsk. Minsk? Okay. Do any of you guys have a childhood hero? Minsk is kind of like my... Childhood hero. I just... I just always liked, you know... His craziness and... You know... I've known about Minsk... Before I could feel attraction to anything in the world. So... No. It's wrong. Yeah, he's like... He's like... He's like my big brother, exactly. Will was actually my very first romance in the game. I wanted to actually romance Gail. And I could see everywhere online how Gail was apparently attracted to everybody and wanted to fuck everybody except me. You could say that I settled for Will, but that's the thing. It wasn't really settling. I think in my first playthrough, I had sex 16 times. I was playing as a bard, and I literally fucked most things that were willing to fuck me. And somehow, I think my game bugged, and I was able to... to romance both Will and Karlak at the same time. And the funny thing is, Will actually proposed to me. And I accepted. But I'm pretty sure I fucked somebody else after that. So, Will... Smash. Shadowheart. Smash. She's funny. She's hot. She's... She's great. Uh, Gail. Smash. I actually waited three years to, to smash Gail, and I couldn't smash Gail until my fourth playthrough. And it was worth it. Because he did not only have an extra cutscene for his romance, he also grew multiple arms just for the sake of pleasuring. Oh. Jahera. If any NPC I would see as a mother figure would be her. Would I smash my own mother? My NPC mother. No. By the way, I am so glad you guys cannot fuck my mother in this game. Halsin, bear with me. In fact, uh, when Larian r first showed that you could have bare sex in Baldur's Gate, I was in the live audience of that show. You can see the exact moment when it happens. And then there is a girl wearing a cloak and she's going, <gasps> It's me. Alfira. She's hot. She's horny. She knows how to sing. Uh, yes. Zevlor. Pets. Damien? We fuck. Kaga. I hate her hair, her hairstyle, so I would actually like to, to smash her, so I get to untie that hairstyle and mess her hair. She's actually, she, she would probably look so hot with messy hair. I, I think you guys know what I, I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. I kind of want her snake to bite me, but just a little bit. Anyways, uh, Natty? Yeah. Roland. You know? Yeah. I like him. He's kind of an asshole, but he gets so much better. And I, I, I do like how cute he is with his siblings. Oh, I forgot the name of this guy. But they it's the Spank Me Senpai. You know what? <sighs> oh, let me think about Roland. I would smash him. My biggest disappointment is that this guy does not show up later in the game. Imagine if he was in the brothel and, and it's a room like... Full of BDSM tools. 
Even if it fades to black. Anyways, the genie? Ooh, let me think about the genie. Uh, oh, this is the, the bitch's face. The, 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 the paladin of tear. He keeps trying to fuck me in the ass. Anders. Yes, Anders. Uh, yeah. Nah. Uh, I'm not a fan of paladins. Oh. Balin. Uh. I think about it. Uh. Casador. Wait, you guys want me to explain the hag? <sighs> guys, I'm the lead writer of hag fan fiction in this community. You guys know that. I have the perfect idea for a hag sex cutscene. Casador. Hmm. Can't handle that. And he strikes me as a whiny bitch. And he's kind of like... A, he seems like the guy that... He looks at you naked and then he comes in his pants. I don't know. No. Ew. Floric. Maybe we should check my screenshots again. Before making a final decision. Yeah. Look at those hips. They don't lie. They don't fucking lie. Aileen? Aileen and Isabel. Can I make a new category that's like for characters that I would like to watch them having sex with each other? I I just feel like I wanna want to ruin. I feel like I feel like Aileen and Isabel, they're just like so perfect for each other that I kinda don't wanna mess with their thing. I just wanna admire it. Does that make sense? I don't know if I would want to interfere with like perfect art. I think you'll put in let me think about it because of that. Catherick. Absolutely. I don't know if it's the voice. I just think that Catherick is actually the hottest bad guy in this game. Human or bones form? Yes. You know, he's a bad guy, but he's kind of like... He's trying to bring back his family. Which is expected from a necromancer, you know? He's kind of like a family guy. I don't know, he, he's pretty darn attractive. The Duke of Baldur's Gate. Okay, the Duke of Baldur's Gate. I think he would have more interesting sex scenes than Will. But the thing about the Duke of Baldur's Gate is that in Dungeons & Dragons, the Duke of Baldur's Gate is always getting fucked in the app. Frick, I'll think about it. Uh, oh! How sick? Yeah, um, I think. She's too worried about money. But she's really good at making summoning circles. I think about it. Raphael. The thing about Raphael is that since I know he comes in two seconds, I, I, I'll have to pass. But. The guy that looks exactly like Raphael, but is actually skilled at sex? Yes. Hell yes. Female her leap? Definitely is match. Oh. This is Hope's sister. Corilla, yes, Corilla. Before she saved me, would be a no. But seeing the way that she slit Prista's gut's throat to save me... It's definitely a yes. Um, Gortash. Would you guys match Gortash? Gortash is, I feel, a lawful evil character. So literally the definition of a lawyer. He's very selfish. And I feel like having sex with selfish people is never a good thing. Nah. Um, uh, Orin. Okay, the thing about Orin is that my sense of self-preservation does not make me want to sleep with her. She's like, she's she's definitely hot and nice to look at, nice to observe from a distance, but you guys, 
Orin doesn't get pleasure from sex. She gets orgasms from killing. So it's likely that she would kill you, transform you into a sex toy, and then probably not even use it. And just go kill somebody else because she got distracted. But what the curiosity kill the cat? Considering she she wears human flesh as clothes, she probably stinks. And smell is a big deal for me. So no. <laughs> yeah. I am attracted to Minecraft. I don't know if it is because the early access that whenever I was about to romance a companion, I would see this picture of this mind player and the under construction text. But but I feel like the Emperor would be less less shy about sticking his tentacles into your holes. But O'Melian is definitely the mind player you want to marry. Blurg. 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 I mean, it's likely that when he was being named, the nurse came to the mom. What would you like to name your son? And and his mom was like, Blurg. she just vomited. And I'm like, oh, Blurg. Nice. No. Lorican. Jesus Christ, no. I think Lorican, he's like exactly like Raphael, except he's not attractive. I feel like it's the best way I can put him. Yeah, same energy as Casador. Yeah. Comes into seconds. And it probably he can only come to the image of him fucking himself. Where's this gut? Yes. What's the name of this ro Robo Goblin? I forgot. It's one of the leaders. Drug Haslin. Yeah. What's the thing that he says when you first see him? Suck my cock. It's a bad look, you know? It comes out as needy and... <sighs> EXCUSE ME?! This is the message that one of my mods sent me as sexy grease?! Are you crazy?! This is exactly how they spells looks in game, that's why you guys always want to use it. I do think that lube is important. Uh, I'll think about it. Uh, this guy... This is the necrophilia guy. I'll think about it. He comes to the Dark Urge. He's like the Dark Urge's um, butler. I'm pretty sure that when the Dark Urge had its memory, it was the guy that was assigned to wipe Dark Urge at. <sighs> nah. <sighs> oh, yes. Oh, dude. What does it like? His voice is fantastic. Okay. Second, for somebody his age, ooh, la la. And. Like, how old is even he? I doubt you look remotely as sexy. And he clearly takes care of himself. He, he's definitely, like... He definitely looks kind of dead, but clean. Oh, He calls me my little rabbit. Oh, he's so sweet. Ah, Yugir. I don't know if I can smash Yugir. He's definitely cute, you know? But I kind of see him, like... I don't know. You really like it. I just Stop. see him see him like family. Yeah, it's kind of like Demon Minsk. Yeah, I think I'll have to pass. Big brother and Viconia. I think before Baldur's Gate 3, Viconia was the most fucked character in Baldur's Gate. I feel like a lot of people did smash her in Baldur's Gate. Viconia had the hottest portrait in Baldur's Gate as well. I mean, she's a draw. I I also really like her name, Viconia the V. It's like so fancy, you know? I'll think about it. Because she tried to kill Boo. Squeak! And I don't know if I can smash somebody that treats Boo like that. You know? 
It just doesn't feel right. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Nine fingers? I have a theory that maybe she cut one of her fingers so she could fin finger herself better. Wait, what? Maybe it was hard to put multiple fingers down there and then she, she got one from a place that wasn't working and then she tied to the others and then... I think she's really hot. I think she's one of the hottest ladies in this entire game. Jokes aside, she's tough, but deep inside, like, she she has a heart. Even though she says that she's going to kill Minsk, she, she really didn't want to, but she did because she had to protect the city against the Absolute and he was being, you know, manipulated by it. So I feel like in a way, even though she would never admit it, she was inspired by our old heroes, Minsk and Jahira, and that's part of why she does what she does. I don't know. I think, like, she's very tough but cute. Okay, Nier, I think, is the first draw in the existence of draw that I'm actually not attracted at all to this guy. Like, I hope he never comes near me. Orpheus. Okay. That's a loaded one. Um, yeah, I would smash. Here's the thing about Orpheus. You don't hang out much with him, but I know he kind of looks like Grinch. But first, there's something sensual about a comet. Uh, second, that he's willing to become what he hates the most for his people. I don't know, I just admire him a lot. He seems to be a very ho honorable person. I, I, I don't know. Grinch. Grinch was the most shocking revelation I had in this game. I never expected this guy to be good. Yes, I would smash. Fuck no. I think it's between the screaming, uh, the, the... She's literally, she's literally a bitch queen. I mean, lich queen. Uh, kind of rotten in and out, uh, loud, uh, not in a good way. No. Is this Barkus? I feel like Barkus is the kind of guy that would reject me. Very nicely. And then I would be heartbroken. Barkus has a lot. I don't know. Like, Barkus has such a good heart. I'll think about it. Uh, yes. In fact, he has fucked me multiple times. Like, he has crit me from behind. He's the Dryader. In the beginning of Act 2, the spider guy. No, he's hot. Yeah. Mizora? I remember the first time that I had a sex scene with Mizora, there was somebody named Jesus in chat. And he wasn't happy with it. But yes. Uh... This is the surgeon. Malostorn? It would be like having sex with Edward Scissorhands. I guess if he's good with his mouth. Um, pass. This is a Gondian. Yeah, no. Gondians are... Balthazar. I feel like I would rather romance his mother that's in the shelf than him. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Especially because he's willing to do anything. He, he will do from missionary to role play as anyone you want. You know? Especially some sexy draw, you know? I think he pulls a really good dress. Yes. The lady? Definitely. But she's more like the holding hands kind of, kind of girl. But definitely. This guy? This guy's kind of like the definition of an edgy teenager? No. His penis might even be pointy like a spear. That's how edgy he is. 
Velo. When we were playing as a randomizer, and Volo was transformed into a rat, he looked more attractive then. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. Valeria? Hmm. Do you guys think she can do any, any nice tricks with her trunk? Yeah. I'm curious. Uh... I think Seravok. I'm just so disappointed at him. Like, I literally gave him part of my soul. So he would come back to life. And he started being a decent guy and changing his life. And then he went right back to sucking Ball's dick. And his balls too. And then he has a daughter. That he has sex with, and then he has Orin. Orin is both his granddaughter and daughter. No. What? Huh. Have you guys been paying attention to the lore? Really nice voice, though. Where is Shadow Heart's parents? I'll definitely fuck her father. Mom, not so much. There's no Zaza. Zaza is definitely attractive. Wolburn? I think like Wolverine is the kind of person that I really wish he went back inside the vagina of his mother and never came out again. Mistra. Oh, definitely bang Mistra. Anyone else? Char? No. Char is the goddess of absence. Elminster? Ooh, that's a good one. Elminster. If fucking girl was magical, imagine fucking Elminster. Yeah, I would. I just feel like since Char is the goddess of absence, if you use mash Char, you would feel absence of pleasure. Should we promote Mintara to Astir? Yeah, I think so. I liked when she sat on my face. Gail, I think I'll promote him to Astir because he had many arms doing the sex. I think that's it. The circus owner? Fuck yeah. Yeah, okay. Fine. Dribbles? What's your problem? Uh, let's talk about Grease. Grease is, ex is essential for, for, for good sex. Lubrification is very important. Yeah, without lubrification, the sex would be a lot more rough. Well, I hope you guys liked it. This is the first time I've made a tier list. Uh, I tried to tell you guys honestly. A bunch of people are asking me to explain myself. I have been doing this for the last almost two hours. 